Assalamu alaikum and welcome to story time with Adam. I was just on my way outside with Anissa to uh, explore some puddles. I hear we had some runaways from Anissa's worm farm. The rain really is pouring. Subhanallah. We have so many different kinds of weather. Oh, that reminds me of a story. It was a beautiful summer day. My family and I had just gone to visit the aquarium. We thought it would be nice to have a picnic by the lake before we headed back home. Dad got us a giant tray of Persian kebabs and rice, and we headed towards the harbor front. Oh, kebabs, my favorite. I couldn't wait. We placed the giant tray in the carriage underneath Anissa's stroller. I could smell the delicious kebabs. Oh, my mouth was watering. Oh. We had seen so many amazing creatures, some kind of lot at the aquarium. And after all that walking, I was definitely hungry. As we walked, we noticed the wind picking up. Mama said, you know, Angie's mom texted me while we were at the aquarium. She said something about a tornado going through a nearby city. We would be hit with some thunderstorms. Anissa asked, tornado? Well, she sounded worried. Mama explained that a tornado is a strong spinning, twisting windstorm. Mama and Dad looked at the sky. Dark clouds had gathered. Dad asked if it would be better if we headed back and had our picnic in the car. <laughs> Anissa popped her head out of the stroller and said, Picnic outside. I had to agree with Anissa. Well, what's a little bit of wind? I was sure the thunderstorms wouldn't hit us until later that afternoon. So we kept walking towards the lake. When we got to the picnic tables, we saw that the sky had become really dark. We put down some plates and forks, but they kept flying away. Anissa was given the job to hold them down. We all heaped some buttery rice and toasted tomatoes onto our plates with some beef and lamb and chicken kebabs. Oh, I could hear my stomach growling. I noticed Anissa was having a hard time, so I leaned over the picnic table to help her cut her kebabs. When I sat down to finally dig into my meal, beast meal. Wow. That's when the rain started. We made dua, asking Allah to send us blessings with the rain. Lightning flashed across the sky. I shoveled food into my mouth, but Mama and Daddy quickly picked up Anissa and put her in the stroller. They shouted over the winds and told me to run with them to a small picnic canopy nearby. I just wanted to finish my kebabs. I was so hungry. Big drops of rain were splooshing onto my food. But I just kept eating until I finished my whole plate. That's when I saw Anissa's plate of rice fly into the air. I, I tried to catch it, but it flew away too fast. Dad shouted to me, Son, come! I ran to the tent. Oh, we got drenched even under the tent. The winds were too strong. 
lightning flashed across the sky and the loud thunder rumbled. Oh, Anissa held out her hand from under the rain cover on her stroller. She was feeling scared. I held her hand and I tried to comfort her by singing a lullaby. Everyone knows what a beautiful voice I have. Can you sing your favorite lullaby? Oh, beautiful! A little while later, water started to rise out of the sewers. Yikes! It splashed onto our feet. I could smell sewage pee. Ugh. We were going to need a good bath. Dad said, well, we went from seeing underwater creatures at the aquarium to becoming underwater creatures ourselves. Ha! We all laughed. And then we went home. The end. Fun story. Ooh, I'm glad you liked it, Anissa. Subhanallah. That was such an interesting day. Have you ever been caught in a big storm? How did you feel? Rain. Blessing from Allah. That's right, Anissa. Rain is a big blessing from Allah. Without it, we wouldn't have water to drink or trees to make oxygen. Come to think of it, Anissa, you reminded me of the blessing of rain in the episode, Adam's Rainy Day. Watch it! Yes, you can check it out on the Adam's World app at www.adamsworldapp.com. Well, we had better go and catch those worms. Worms? Yeah. Let's go. Assalamu alaikum. Salam.